not where the Pokeball- Oh, are you s Are you serious? Are you serious right now? Did that just happen? I think I just, uh... Pretty sure I just ran away from that Zubat. I'm pretty sure that I, uh... I ran away by accident there. I was going over to the bag. And I hit run away. Whatever, fuck this Sandshrew. <laughs> I got a critical hit. That was a critical hit? Oh man. This cave. This game is way easier if you just focus on one Pokemon and not level everybody up at the same time. This game became like 10 times more challenging just by trying to level up multiple Pokemon. Like I said, I usually just go like balls to the wall on one kind and then it's just that Pokemon takes me to the end. Fall asleep playing the game. But right now, this is actually getting pretty intense. Charmeleon's down to like half health. Butterfree can't do fuck all for our team because it doesn't do anything. Alright, let's take out this Ratatat though. Butterfree's got this. If it knew Sleep Spore. We might be actually getting somewhere in this game. We'd be able to do what that Jigglypuff and that Clefairy did to me like a couple minutes ago. Holy shit. Oh my god, Butterfree's dead. Butterfree's fucking dead. Alright. Let's just let Charmeleon rack up the XP ray real, real quick. We need to have at least one strong Pokemon to be able to go through the next area. Fuck this rat that dead. This thing's kicking my ass. At least Charmeleon's level 17. It's one thing to look forward to, I guess. And then there's a Zubat that I never got to catch because I ran away from it. Like a dumb. Defeated Rocket. And we get an item for defeating Rocket. We got an HP up. I don't even like really fully remember what HP ups do. I think they might increase your max HP for a Pokemon. So I guess if you were really, really keen on this game, you could get a Pokemon with 999 HP. Legit. If you had two games and you traded items a whole bunch, but... That would take a pretty fucking long time. I am not up for doing that. Let's go heal Butterfree. Let's be smart, and let's go heal Butterfree. And Charmeleon. Charmeleon's down like 16 HP or something stupid. I'm not okay with that. We're really close to being able to do this glitch, though. It really just comes down to getting an Abra. If I catch a Clefairy, I'm gonna have to level up to like a level 19. Or something like that. How much, uh... Hold on. There's Joy, you gotta shut the fuck up for a second. Butterfree stats. Speed is 23. Oh, damn, that's perfect. If it knew Stun or Sleep Spore, we would have this. And the reason why you need to know, like, Sing or Sleep is to catch Abra. And you need at least, like, a speed of 23 to get the first hit in the fight. Okay, I'm not fucking this up this time. Zubat is gonna be mine. I've never cared so much about catching a Zubat in my entire life. I mean, I guess you could just like throw Pokeballs willy-nilly to catch Abra, but... 
You'd have to get pretty lucky, because if it breaks out, it teleports. And we ain't got no Great Balls. We only got Pokeballs. Damn, this thing's got some health. Compared to, like, the level 7? This thing's doing good. Alright, here we go. If this thing gets out of this Pokeball, it deserves to live. There you go. Zubat is now ours. He was caught. That's the other difference about this between the older versions and the newer versions. The newer versions actually have genders. The older ones, the only ones that have genders is like Nidoran and Nidoran. Those are the only two, I think. There might be a couple others, but... Those are the only two that I remember. Everything else just doesn't have a gender sign at all. Uh, Super Nerd wants to fight. Super Nerd's about to get fucked up. Except for I don't want to fight him with my Butterfree. Because Butterfree won't do anything to him. This is like one of the few Pokemon that we've fought so far that I've been super effective against. Other than bug Pokemon, but... They don't really count because they're so easy anyway. Charmeleon's definitely got the advantage, though. Gonna burn that steel. Finally! My god! Butterfree learned confusion! Moving up in the world. Alright, Butterfree. See how much damage this confusion does. Oh shit. That wasn't that bad. If you guys uh, suffer from seizures in any way, shape, or form, that might be not good for you. Just as a warning. Now, Confusion's pretty good. I like it. A Pokemon won't do. Because my Pokemon are better. We got a potion. I'm pretty sure this is a rare candy. Yeah. Go through this cave to get to... Cerulean City, or Cerulean, whatever you want to call that. Alright, Butterfree's gonna get some levels now. Now that we know Confusion, leveling up will be done. Look at that. Look how much damage that did to Caterpie compared to Tackle. My god. This is a beautiful day, now that we've learned confusion. You guys remember that Metapod that took like 10 years to fight? Not anymore. Now it's gonna be like a three hit kill. I accidentally hit my pop filter. Well, not bad, hopefully you guys didn't, hopefully that didn't make like a shit ton of noise in the microphone. Yeah, level 13. Butterfree's just flying. It's fantastic. Alright, let's, uh, see what this one is. Found an escape rope. That's good. I like that. I 
I'm just gonna take a guess that Confusion's not that great against Zubat. Seeing as it's a psychic attack. Oh, wow. <laughs> Boy, was I wrong. <laughs> Holy shit. I just got schooled by Pokemon itself. That's bullshit. <laughs> Butterfree is the way to go in this cave, and I guess we searched everything here. Butterfree is the way to go. I, like, legitimately surprised the shit out of me there. I only have 15 uses left, though. We're gonna have to, like, switch Pokemon or something. Wow, it's way bigger in here than I thought. Holy shit. It's not something that I would expect last to say. She busted out an oddish, though. Bust out a confusion. Oh, yeah, I got another message. People are just fucking... All day with that shit. Apparently I'm popular. Even though it's one person. That seems to be like the way it works with with people though. You got like one person that texts you like nonstop. And like the people other than that one person just don't give a shit. I did one damage. And that was a critical hit. Now we're level 14. Can I please have sleep powder, like, soon? Sometime in, like, the not too distant future, I would like to have sleep powder. I better not be, like, a level 20 move. I'm gonna be pissed. We still have six levels to go, if that's the case. I don't remember it being, like, that far up in the world of things that you learn, though. I remember it being a, like, pretty... pretty basic one. It's like, you have a Butterfree, you know, you know, Sleep Powder. These are Pokemon are starting to level up a little bit, though. We're pulling a big joke here. Or a big job. I'll call it a joke anyway, though. Uh, get lost, kid. Team Rocket is a joke. In this game. They suck. Oh, man, he's got a zoo bad. I don't know if Butterfree can handle this. I don't know. I only have eight confusions left. I'd actually survive that? Holy shit. And it's supersonic mist. Oh, that sucks for that guy. About to use Ekans. What's good against Ekans? Use confusion? Is this gonna be a, a big hit? Or a little hit? Super effective. I love it. That I don't like so much. Guy Atkins is just going. God damn. He made me work for that shit. And we got a critical hit too. There we go. 